Are you ready for the second round? All right, as usual, the first contestant is Tamima Tabasun. Tamima, are you ready? Let's start with Tamima. First word for the second round for Tamima is filigree. It means delicate and intricate ornamentation. Filigree. How do you spell the word? F-I-L-I-G-R-Y. All right. Tamima's word was filigree. Unfortunately, that was not correct. You have done well up until the last letters. That is double E, not an Y or an I. The next word for Tamima is extol. It means praise, glorify or honor. Extol. How would you spell the word? E-X-T-O-L-E. The word is? Extol. All right, Tamima. I'm very sorry to let you know it is not correct. Good effort. You've done it well except for the last E. It was unnecessary. But... Good effort. The last word for you in this round is dystopia. It means state in which the conditions of life are extremely bad. The word is dystopia. How would you spell that? D I S T O P H I A. Dystopia. I'm sorry, Tamima. That is not the correct spelling. Good effort, by the way. It is D Y S T O P I A. But good effort. We are going to move on to the next contestant. Afshin, are you ready? The first word for Afshin in the second round is utopia. It means ideally perfect state. Utopia. How would you spell the word? U-T-O-P-I-A. Utopia. And it is absolutely correct. Good job. Utopia is correct. The next word for Afshin is truculent. It means defiantly aggressive. Truculent. How would you spell the word? T R U. Q U L E N T Truculent. Unfortunately, that is incorrect. It's T R E T R U C U L E N T Truculent. The last word for Afshin in this round is sycophantic. It means attempting to win favor or flatter. Sycophantic. How would you spell the word? S Y C O P H A N T I C. Sycophantic. And you're absolutely correct. Sycophantic is the correct spelling of the word. Thank you, Afshin. You did well in this round. And now we have the next contestant, Hafsa. The first word for Hafsa is belligerent. It means characteristic of an enemy or one eager to fight. And how would you spell it? B-E-L-L-I-G-E-R-E-N. Good job, Hafsa. It is absolutely correct. Good effort. The next word for Hafsa is axiom. It means a proposition that is not susceptible of proof or disproof. Axiom. How would you spell the word? A X I O M. Axiom. A X I O M. And that is the correct spelling. Good job, Hafsa. The final spelling for Hafsa in this round is Zephyr. It means a slight, usually refreshing wind. Zephyr. Z E P H Y R. Zephyr. All right, that is the correct spelling, Hafsa. Good job. You've done very well on this round. And we're going to move on to the next contestant today. That is Zunaira Tanaz Labiba. Zunaira, the first word for you today is. Purgatory. It means a temporary state of the dead in Roman Catholic theology. Purgatory. How do you spell the word? P U R G A T O R Y. Purgatory. And that is absolutely correct. Good job, Zunaira. The next word for Zunaira is ominous. The meaning is threatening or foreshadowing evil or tragic developments. How would you spell the word ominous? O M I N O U S. All right, Zunaira, and that is correct. The spelling is absolutely correct. Good job. The last word for Zunaira in this round is nostalgia. It means a longing for something past. N-O-S-T-A-L-G-I-A. Nostalgia. And it is absolutely correct. Good job, Zunaira. You've done really well. You've answered all three words correctly in this round. That is a very good effort. Now we are going to move on to Fatiha Bin Teiman, our fifth contestant of the day. The first word for you is invective. It means abusive language used to express blame or censure. Invective. How do you spell the word? I N V E C T I V E invective. And it is absolutely correct. Good job, Fatiha. The second word for Fatiha bin Taiman is hypodermic. It means a piston syringe that is fitted with a needle for injections. Hypodermic. How would you spell the word? H Y P O D E R M I C. Hypodermic. And it is absolutely correct. Good job, Fatiha. The last word for you in this round is guileless. It means innocent and free of deceit. How do you spell the word? Guileless. G-I-L-E-S. Guileless. 
unfortunately it is wrong this time it is not the correct spelling the correct spelling is g u i l e l e double -S, s guileless okay all right that was it for the fifth contestant last but not the least we have fatiha bint sharir for the second round the first word for fatiha bint sharir is dearth it means an insufficient quantity or number dearth how do you spell it dearth d e a r t h dearth and that is absolutely correct good job fatiha that is correct the second word for fatiha is cupidity it means an extreme greed for material wealth how do you spell the word cupidity c u P I D I T Y cupidity and that is absolutely correct good job fatiha the last word for fatiha in the last well the second round for the last contestant is buccaneer it means someone who robs at sea or plunders the land from the sea buccaneer how would you spell the word b u c c a n e e r and that is absolutely correct good job fatiha on the last word of the round Buccaneer is correctly spelled.